Hi guys, Alec Pierce, Vintage Scuba. I got a couple of really interesting and very old dive masks to show you. Now, you know, I've often said, you may have seen in my tech tips, you may have seen me or seen me writing there and saying that the single most important piece of equipment you'll ever own is your mask. And I firmly believe that, I really do. The mask has to fit. It has to be, you know, not leak. It has to be comfortable. All kind of, if the mask isn't good, you're not going to enjoy scuba diving. If you don't enjoy scuba diving, you're not going to scuba dive. So it's over. Again, the single most important. A lot of people think it's a regulator of the tank. No, the mask is most important. Masks have changed a great deal. I got a couple of masks here. Now, you might laugh at these, but these are genuine scuba diving masks for divers. Okay? They may look, uh, well, they do actually look kind of old and, and a little funny, but let's take a peek at them and I'll show you what I mean. Here's the box that comes in, okay? This, this particular mask that I'm showing you right now is made by a company called Healthways. One of the big five was around from, oh, I'm going to guess the early 50s through until the late 60s. A big, big company, rival Aqualung at the time. Very innovative company. Their regulators and other equipment were very innovative. Very special, extremely well made, and, and leading edge as well. It was a great company, long gone. And they sold everything, mass snorkels, fins, tanks, regs, BCs, they sold the whole gamut. Not too many BCs, they didn't have them. But anyway, and this is one of their dive masks. Now it's important that you recognize that this is a professional deep sea dive mask. This is not a toy. <laughs> a little bit of marketing maybe in there, but they do the same thing today. You see the same stuff on, you see two masks side by side. One is, it'll say standard and one will say professional. They're both the same, different colors. But anyway, this is a professional deep sea diving mask. Yeah, no fooling around. And there's a fellow wearing the mask and uh, here's a fellow down here spearing a monstrous fish. So if you want to spear a monstrous fish, this is the mask to buy. That's the uh, subliminal message anyway. huh? And it's a pretty neat box actually, uh, features Never before achieved in any one mask. Adjustable straps and uh, uh, other stuff. Choice of the expert, skin diver. Woohoo, that's the one I want. And it's just an un unbelievable box. Let's take a look inside. Let's take a look at this unbelievable mask and see what it looks like. Okay, I'm going to open the box carefully. This box is 60 years old. And then when we look inside, we see that what looks like a brown piece of seaweed. Well, this particular mask was actually <clears throat> made from gum rubber. And you can see that this gum rubber has gone quite stiff and deformed. The mask itself is brand spanking new. Uh, it's never been used. And it has the usual metal clips on the sides. It's really hard to see. I'm sorry about that, Kev. It's hard to see. I don't want to pull it apart too much. But you see the thick uh, split, uh, single rubber strap single seal just stuck on your face and hopefully it's sealed pretty well. I wanted to read that to you about the instructions on there Kevin, they're pretty cute. To prevent fogging it's necessary to rub the inside of the glass with fog proof compound or a piece of raw potato. If not available use seaweed or saliva <laughs> then rinse in the water in which you want to die. And uh, pretty neat, these old instructions on this dear old mask, been around for a long time, 60 year old mask. Oh, I wanted to point this out as well. On the inside of the mask, it comes with some important safety suggestions. Wear the mask over the forehead, eyes, and nose. Good point. Uh, no, positively avoid horseplay while wearing mask or goggles, which have glass lenses and so on. Pretty neat. And then, more safety suggestions in here. So these, these masks, these old masks actually came with some literature that was actually useful. It wasn't just a piece of literature that talked about the warranty. I didn't see any warranty information in there. I don't think they had much of a warranty. Let's take a look at this other one over here now. This is pretty, I'm going to, I'm going to skip that one for a minute, Kevin. Here's another old, old mask. Now there's, there's no writing on this mask that I'm aware of at all. Maybe for some of my old vintage buddies watching, they might recognize this mask. I have no idea where I got this, where it came from, but it is a dive mask. Is that writing on the inside there? My gosh, look at that. I think there is something in there. Deluxe Dolphin. Uh, but this is, uh, this is plastic. It's a little plastic globe. You see that? Your face sticks out. You can see through the side there, and there's the front, and then there's a rubber skirt that sticks on it, and that's the edge of the skirt that sort of sticks to your face, and one little strap around the bass. But this, you know, these may look like toys, but these were actually the dive masks 
that divers used in the 50s and 60s. I was very fortunate, I guess, by the time I became a diver in the late 50s, 58, 59, there were better masks around. They were actually good quality black rubber masks. But these were actually masks that were sold to the very earliest divers in the 50s and 60s. Now, I wanted to show you one more. And this is not that, that, that special a mask, but the box is great. I mean, check this box out. You can zoom in there, Kevin. Wow, <laughs> that's a mask I want. You haven't even seen the mask yet. But the box is fantastic. Comes in a couple different colors, a couple different sizes. It's just the box alone for the mask is fantastic. Let's take a look at the mask. It's pretty straightforward. A typical, old-fashioned. This one's in great shape, almost new. Made by Healthways again, by the way. A special tempered lens. They're all tempered lenses now, but when they were plastic, and then they went to glass, and then they went to tempered glass, that was a big deal. So for a long time, they wrote, tempered glass, this mask is special. Now they're all tempered glass. So it's pretty straightforward uh, design based on that old, famous old style, oval, clamp, metal, and a band. And this is a split band in pretty good shape and so on. So the mask is, is a, a real nice mask as well. But I, it's the box that I fell in love with. I also wanted to show you this, this other stuff. Here, this is from the same company, Healthways. And it talks about the safety suggestions, same thing, positively avoid horseplay, never dive headfirst into a crowded pool or water while wearing the mask and so on. But this is kind of neat. Look what I found on the bottom here, Kevin. This is pre 1961, this mask, okay? This is Healthways Skin and Scuba Diving Equipment. So they got a little catalog in here. That's, that's a good move. That's a good move on the company's part. You get a mask, you get a little catalog of all their products. Well, this is actually a pretty extensive catalog. Watch this. Okay, two hose regulator. There's the regulators that Healthways uh, made, and I have all those regulators, and they're fantastic regulators. So this, look at this. This is what you get with your mask. There's the scuba tank and the valves, J valve, and the so on. Spear guns. See the spear guns there, Kevin? And 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 they, they got some fins over here as well. The rondine that was a famous famous fin, and so on. Okay, look over here now, on the other side. This is pretty good. We got the masks. There's the mask. In fact, there's the, ma there's the professional mask right there. Look at that. And so on. So all kinds of masks in there and goggles and little life vests. We wouldn't wear these little life vests because only sissies wear those. <laughs> Watches and so on. And gauges and snorkels. There's a wetsuit. Goodness. And there's a decompression meter. I have one of these as well. An old decompression meter from 1961, believe it or not. So this is pretty neat. I found that in there. A little catalog of Healthways diving equipment from the, uh, from the early 60s in the bottom of that mask. Anyway, that's what I wanted to show you. I was cleaning out some of my vintage gear and I came across these two or three masks. I picked up this box and I said, boy, oh boy, if I was a brand new diver, 10, 11, 12, 13, 20, 25 years old, and I saw a box like this, I'd be saying, that's the mask I want. They did, they did a good job of marketing, and a good old mask, too, from those old companies. Anyway, a little bit of interesting stuff on there, and, and I hope you got, uh, got a bit of a laugh out of that. Alec Pierce from Vinti Scuba, some old masks.